right now we are at the widest part of the Danube we've been to yet. It's uh, Slovakia, uh, sort of crossing onto the border between Hungary and Slovakia. We had to go down into the Lok Gapčakovo, down the canal, and uh, once we got down there it was crazy, the weather was pretty bad, and there was waves, and, and they were telling us we had to turn around, but eventually we made it in and, and down. And thank you to all the people who helped us there, it was great. After we passed through the Loch of Gapchakovo, we were looking for a marina to stay a night in, but we couldn't quite find one directly after, so we had to do a little bit of night sailing. There's quite a few lights on the Danube that show you the way, and we always make sure to have our lights on, and it can be quite beautiful sometimes. For a rough few days of sailing and rowing, and passing through the Loch of Gapchakovo, we found our way to a nice little Hungarian marina. Now we're in one of the most beautiful parts of the Danube in Hungary. And uh, yeah, we came to Kishmarosh, a small town on the riverbank of the Danube. We've been staying here for around three days, doing some work and getting things done, and it's lovely and couldn't have asked for a better place to rest after a long, hard row.